All right, here we go. Another repentance run. Let's see what we start with today. Uh oh. Mystery uh, book and uh, Bomb's Eye. So, not too bad. Also, Blue Baby's other friend. But before I get too far into the, today's run, here's a comment that I picked out. This one's from Edwin8 here. It says, I'm glad you're doing videos. I don't have the courage to do it myself. You know what? I'm well encouraged. I think you can do it. Uh, daily videos, you get the hang of it after doing it for a little bit. And you know what? Sometimes even I feel like not doing it, but I push through and, well, here we are. <laughs> well, hope, hope you stick around and uh, continue enjoying, enjoying the stuff. Thank you for the comment. All right. Always, always good to see people joining in. All the other goodness. Uh, if it doesn't seem like it, I'm actually a little tired. I spent about an hour and a half offloading some mulch and compost for uh, for the garden. Yeah. So it's, it's 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 a little something. I I probably should have blown that up. I should have just moved it to the the secret room there, and then you know blown it up then, so that way we'd get free access instead of wasting a bomb. Eh, a little bit of misplay, but you know what? It is what it is. I think we're gonna have a really good run today. Hmm. <laughs> okay then, get ourselves a golden poop here. Come on, dime. Ah, uh, not quite, but we got a lot of money. That means we can look inside the shop here and maybe, maybe find something really, really good. Inside here is jumper cables. Alright, well, jumper cables aren't bad, but I don't see us giving up the Book of, or book of Secrets uh, anytime soon. So let's use this bomb instead for a super secret room. Generally, the super secret rooms aren't really worth it, but sometimes they are. All right, he gave me a pill. What's it gonna be? And I can see forever. Oh, not too bad. It's good to see that that's identified for us now. Oh. Buttons. Somehow buttons are worse than pills. I don't know how that happened, but it did. But with uh, Blue Baby's only friend here, we can essentially keep ourselves quite safe, especially against a boss like this champion, Gertie. And gradually take them out. Which helps quite a bit. And we get ourselves a luck and health upgrade. And you know what? This uh this beginning floor isn't isn't looking too good to be honest. Our our stats, which I haven't even talked about yet. Uh let's see. Our movement speed's good. Our damage is not good. But it's it's being supplemented by Blue Baby's only friend. Because that's our main source of damage right now. And our fire rate also is not good. <laughs> I mean, it, it's better than most runs I've had. You know, you never know. You could start with, like, a fire rate that's much lower than uh, your own damage stat. Or higher? Come on, blue baby. There we go. Now, it is a, it is a little bit jarring to use blue baby's only friend. It's like trying to use... Uh, uh-oh. I put myself in a bad position. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Let's take care of these dudes first. And you know what? Since we're here, we might as well see what's inside the devil deal. I don't think we're going to get too much out of it. You know, wise words before destruction or something. Or not destruction, uh, tragedy. Famous last words. That's what I meant to say. But I'm trying to get rid of the little one first because he's more annoying. Mostly because he spits that homing shot and, you know, when he becomes baby raging mode, he chases after us and it's a little more difficult to use. Alright, we just get HP after HP. And we get control tiers and... Ah, uh, fine. I, I typically don't like picking up... This item because I don't really like controlling the tiers. I like just having to send them out and you know being as they are. And especially when if we're gonna be using Blue Baby's only friend, then it's gonna be a little more a little more difficult to use the tiers and and Blue Baby's only friend. But we're also gonna be picking up Hemolacra here, which is a fantastic item. In my opinion. It is very very nice you know getting all these extra shots here maybe we can find 
or hopefully we can find uh membership card ain't bad we're not gonna go down there yet just in case we see an item that we want and but we can't afford it so we'll have to look for the rest of the floor and see if there's any any more money which does not look like there's going to be sadly And there's a tenant rock. Okay, well, we get back a little bit of HP or just get more damage, lower our movement speed. I mean, hey, why not? Our movement speed's not too bad, and I completely missed the fact that we can go into the curse room over here, but I managed to do it anyway. And I think that's it for this floor. There's really not too much we can do. I mean, I guess we could go inside the arcade over here and maybe try to play something, but ah, I'm feeling a little lazy. I don't feel like doing that. So let's just uh, go down to the next floor. Down we go. Wee. Yeah, I'm definitely, definitely really tired. Uh, we had a truck, a pickup load of, uh, of mulch. Or should I say compost? And it, uh, I had to unload it off of the truck and onto a tarp and then take scoop it into a bucket and then put the uh, bucket along the the um, the rows and uh, it took about an hour and a half you know you're, you're moving the buckets around there like what like 10 15 pounds per bucket so it's not like a huge pain in the butt or like hugely exhausting but when you haven't done something for a while you can you can definitely feel it and you know shoveling all that all that compost has definitely put a little bit of a, uh, a dinge in my back. Uh, I feel like I'm like much older than I should be. Or I'm feeling much older than I should be. And we get synth oil, which is damage and range. That's pretty good. I am going to backtrack because I do want to find the, the white fire, which I don't think it was this way. No, 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 it wasn't. It was over here. Ah, the rest of the level, which I haven't haven't explored yet. All right, let's see what's inside our item room here. And it's gonna be Spoonbender. Okay, well, maybe I should have taken the blind item. Hmm, thinking back, I probably should have taken the blind item because Spoonbender, it's good. Don't get me wrong, homing is like one of the best effects in this game next to flying, but it's not really going to do too much because we have Ivy Cult, which, you know, kind of removes homing a little bit. I mean, it's working slightly. Let's see what we got inside here. A seven cent BFF. Hmm. Tempting. Tempting indeed. But before we do all that we are going to go over here and go inside our secret room and look at that we didn't even have to blow up the donation machine you can get that bff that will make uh seven steels stronger that'll make uh blue baby's only friend stronger and you know what it makes makes the day so much better uh do i want to go inside the curse room with okay it didn't I was expecting the curse room to like screw us and then or the uh, the lost form to screw us and then put us back into the regular form so we'd lose the half half less soul heart. I mean that's just what I was expecting. Come over here and grab all this money. We could also go and buy that black uh, demon heart that's down in the the uh, member shop. But I, don't, I think I think we'll be fine for right now. We'll, we'll see what, how, how we're looking after this boss fight. Because there's a good chance that there's going to be um, HP from it. Alright, still no enemies. And you know what? I'm A-OK -okay with that. Getting rooms where you don't have to clear. Now this weekend, I'm going to be putting in a lot of work for uh, the channel. Uh, unless I keep getting distracted by, you know, constantly having to work in the garden and farm and all that other stuff but hey you know sometimes life comes and hits you and you just gotta roll the punches you know even though 
I, I've talked about how how uh, important time management is in recent recent videos. Uh, I'm sorry, I'm, I'm stuttering a little bit here. I'm trying to think about what I want to do for the rest of this floor. Uh, I think that might just be it. Yeah, I think that's going to be it for this floor. So let's just, yeah, let's just go ahead and head down. There's really not much else for us to do. I don't even know why I'm going this way. I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> uh, man, what a good floor. BFF, that's going to, that's going to help significantly. Because sometimes Seven Seals, like, he, he decides, especially when he's in the war form, he decides to go and start chewing on people's ankles, and you know what? I'm A-OK -okay with that. If he wants to get aggressive and charge right in and start beating, beating nerds. But yeah, back to the uh, time management thing. I Before, because I, I, I tend to go on tangents, but before I forget, uh, the, uh, you know what? I already forgot. Wow. Uh, you can see Spoonbender helping a little bit. It's not it's not a strong effect, but it, there there is an effect happening. There we go. Finally. And we got ourselves a soul heart for our troubles. Thank you, game. So let's just continue on here and maybe figure out, like, look at that. The war fly, or the Seven Seals war went in there and started chewing that Isaac's head. He'd love to see it. But... There's a tenant rock right there. You can tell by the little X. You may have to pause the video because I didn't, you know, stop and actually describe. I uh, do need to be a little, you know what? Give me those adoption papers. I'm in the mood to, to increase our family. Well, maybe maybe not in that sense. Let's see what's down here. <laughs> uh, 43 cent dead cat. Hmm. I don't think we're going to be able to get that much money. But I do think we should blow up the donation machine here. And then see where we're sitting at. And then do a full clear... For the rest of the floor and see where we're sitting at at that point because money is pretty important we could get dead cat we could also get uh, the pentagram there we could get you know there's, there's a bunch of good stuff there that we want and money is going to be the top priority so just like in real life we're gonna have to be looking at some way of making that dough okay drag mag mega and uh, my most hated boss just falls over dead. All right, I love it. And I also love flying. Let's use two bombs here before we forget, because I do like going down these alt paths. And sometimes there is fool's gold in there. Not this time, though. Not this time. Ooh, careful now. There's a fire there. <laughs> I need to remember that. And let's clear the rest of this floor out and see what kind of, where we're sitting at money-wise. Oh, I remember what I was going to say with the whole time management thing. Money. Um, sometimes life comes in and, you know, messes up your plans. No matter how much you, like, try to, you know, plan everything out. You know, I was talking about the time management and how uh, it, it helps quite a bit if you... If you, uh, man, my brain is just dying today. I, I probably should have taken a break for a little bit before, you know, because I just came straight back from, uh, from working outside. But we're going to blow these mushrooms up just to see if we can find magic mush or mini mush or something like that. All right, nothing. Agalos makes you invincible. Uh, Sure, we can use it to get out of here. I, I don't feel like taking the damage as of right now. And... Alright, well, we are probably going to be able to get nine lives. Wield of 
but we're probably not going to be able to afford anything else, sadly. Okay, okay. I, I've, I got the... The coherent sentence in my mind. Let's see if I can effectively say it. I've talked about time management and how important it is if you feel like you're struggling and you're constantly overwhelmed. And the way to do that is by help by writing things down, the things that are the most pressing to you, and then figuring out, you know, breaking them down even further. So, you know, it's like the, the saying, uh, how do you eat an elephant? It's one bite at a time. It's a 43 cent. Hmm. Sadly, we are not going to be able to get that. But 15 and 16. Uh, as much as I like Yo Listen, I like these two bet more. And we did get Leviathan. Wow, I was not really expecting that. Pick up the Soul Heart, and I think we're, I think we're done. This, this could have been a two of diamonds, but it also could have been like, I don't know, an Ace of Hearts. So, yep, I knew that was gonna happen. But. You know, life sometimes come in like today. Like I, I got asked, "Hey, can you come help with uh with something?" I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna have to. And that kind of threw up my plans because you know I wanted to go ahead and you know start making some other content and you know spreading it out. Even though Isaac's gonna be the main part of it. And sometimes you just gotta be okay with that. This is the mines, right? Yeah. It, okay. I was making sure I didn't, like, accidentally not go the right way. Uh, sure. Let's clear out the big room. Easy. We do have a war fly around us, so we have to be a little careful of that, because it does explode. Now, for those of you that have been around, I've said this quite often, but for the new members that have been coming in, because we're, we're slowly growing here, it's, it's awesome to see. Uh, Satanic Bible, I'll have to come back and use it. Because if I use it right now, then we'll get a devil deal for our boss item, which will cost HP, and I don't quite want that yet. But, uh, yeah, with uh, the war flies, the reason why I like really like taking seven seals is that a lot of times you'll come across... Uh, you know, how, how often have you come across where you just have a run where it's just a bunch of bomb upgrades? Quite often, right? Now, Seven Seals, with the War Flies, when it explodes, it will copy your bomb upgrades. Which is, I find, really, really good. Sansom's Chain. Alright, Apple. As you see right there, Isaac sometimes fires Razor Blades that deal 400% or 4 times your damage. And, uh, yeah. It's also a Tears Up, which helps quite a bit with uh, Hemolacrae. Even though it's a little bit... You know, hey, we need every little bit that we can get. Okay, eyes open. That means we're going to do the cross pattern. And Seraphim. Ooh, interesting. Let's see what's inside our membership shop card. Membership shop first. I don't know. Purity is pretty nice, but... I think I'm going to go with the Seraphim. <laughs> with BFF, he's going to be doing, I think, 20 damage? I don't know. We'll have to see there. Yeah, that looked like a bunch. Yeah, 20 damage. Alright, let's go beat up the boss. Man, the wind just picked up something fierce. I'm a little scared now. We got they were, they were calling for rain, but it looks like it's going to be thunderstorms. So, hopefully I can get this video up. Before, you know, have it uploaded before, like, my internet goes out or something. That's one of the problems with living on a farm. Uh, you tend to not have pretty good internet. I mean, the way our, our system is set up is we have, uh... I can't believe I got hit by that. Uh, the way it's set up is... Uh, really? No... No devil deal? I'm a little sad. Anyway, let's go back and pick up the Satanic Bible, because we are going to be using it a little bit. And I think I may actually drop the... Drop the Book of, book of Secrets here. Because we kind of need the HP. I picked up the wrong one. I've been kind of uh, 
neglecting the HP and, you know, in my ramblings and not paying attention to where I'm going, running into stuff. Like those fires. But yeah, my internet, uh, it's, we have the modem and everything that's out by the well house. That's out at the beginning of the farm or when you first come in. No, 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 we're going all path. Get brain. Don't, don't forget that. And, uh, it, uh, we have to, like, broadcast it. It's kind of like satellite to our house. So it's like a half a mile distance. And in order to be able to get, you know, an actual hardwire connection to our house would be something like, well, this was years ago. It was something like 40 grand. You know, 20 grand for the uh, the wire itself, and then another 20 for labor. And that's if you're doing a direct line. If you're following the roads, which, you know, kind of winds around a little bit, then it would take a little, a little bit more. And you know what? I may, since we have so many, since this is a, an XL floor, we're going to have so many rooms to clear. We're going to get a lot of HP. So I'm going to go ahead and just use it now. Even though this will make it so that way we will have uh, one boss drop a double deal. But hopefully we'll end up having enough enough uh, enough uh, HP till then. All right, let's go with the mystery item, and it's odd mushroom. Uh, eh, that 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 doesn't hurt too bad. You know, one damage down, but you know, with our humor lacria and homing and all the shots moving around, I think we'll be a okay. The the real benefit was actually the tears up. Was that what what caused him to skirt down like that? Do we have something that I don't recognize? We don't have God's Flesh. Why did he shrink like that? Or was that just like a champion thing? Uh, I'm going to wait to go inside there. So I do want to go to the boss room first. And then use the stars card. Because we can actually make it to boss rush. Uh, even if it goes past the 20 minutes... One reason like why I like coming down to uh, Guiana here is that the boss rush is actually at 25 minutes. Since you're going alt pass and it takes extra time, you can they they increase the time of boss rush from 20 minutes to 25 minutes. Hmm. Trying not to get in there. Get in there. Seven seals. Uh, you did not get in there like I thought you were going to. We don't have any red heart HP, so we can't make too much use of that yet. So I think the uh, the method of attack here with Hemolacria and I have a, well, our shots here, I should uh, point out, is actually just fire them. And if they go past, just stop firing. Because then the homing will take effect after that. And Guppy's tail... You know what? Sure, we can we can take Guppy's tail. Take the negative for the extra damage. The mark gives us HP. I mean, it's just more damage. I know Sulfur is so good, but, you know, we can't really give up the book of... The Satanic Bible here. So let's see. Scatter bombs... Sad Onion, a 0.7 tears up, which isn't is going to be reduced quite a bit from uh, from uh, I think Sad Onion here is actually the best option. We could go Scatter Bombs, but I don't think that's a good combo. So yeah, let's go with that, and maybe we can get enough charges since this is a double charge. Since it's a two-sized room, we can get more more charges for the Satanic Bible. So let's let's just do this for a little bit. I mean, Boss Rush is only going to be 15 waves. It's not going to take that long. And, well, the bosses aren't really that hard. The next thing we got to watch out is for, like, Adversary here, where he... Yeah, the Brimstone. 
the random burnstone shots, and... Ooh, a battery. Thank you. Well, we're gonna wait. We're gonna wait. We don't have to clear this one, and then we can pick up the battery. See that, Spider Baby? Or Spider Mod? Not Spider Baby. Spider Baby's a transformation. Man, we are doing some significant amount of damage, and yes, I will actually be going to fight Hush, because, you know, this this build's actually pretty good. Oh, I didn't even see him show up. But we're definitely going to increase, increase our HP more than we're going to lose it. Oh, there they are. I thought it was going to be like a pin or something. Uh, one thing we can do... Ooh, thank you for the soul heart. A nerd. Uh, let's blow up these skulls. Because they could give us... Well, host hats is the most obvious or most likely thing that they're going to give us. But they could also give us, you know, some form of tarot card which will help us. And speaking of... Post hats. There is one. Fire a couple of that and let the homing do the rest. Don't fire it till you see the whites of their eyes. As I'm pre firing. And we did all that for suplex. Uh, not the worst item in the world. I mean, suplex is good and all. But not today. And I will be taking a warm buddy. <laughs> uh, let's go back and find our shop and then head down to the next floor. Because uh, we're going to be skipping the womb 1 and going straight to womb 2. Which is fantastic. I really hate being in the womb. Well, let me rephrase that so that's not taken out of context. Uh, I hate being on the floor in the womb. <laughs> And that is not our shop. And of course, it's going to be the opposite direction. All the way over here. Hopefully, membership card. We do, surprisingly, have a decent amount of money right now. So we could make good use of membership card down in the hush fight. Because that is, technically, this floor is our last shop if we didn't make the hush fight. But, we are definitely going to make it. Like, there's no way it's going to take us, like, 10 minutes to get down there. And look at that. A five cent twisted pair. <laughs> Adoption papers, I love you. Uh, hopefully we can get conjoined here. Um, hmm. Do we take the torn photo? Do we have enough now? Because I, I want a daddy long legs. Hey, look at that. We do have enough. It was 19. And it's just a shot speed up. Well... I was not paying attention and didn't realize that we didn't have that much, so... Money? No, no money. Well, I'm, I'm saying money because I want an extra battery. And I think we're just going to be done with this floor. Let's see, we... Left with... Well... Well, it's brain cells and we came in because we just ran into a spike rock. And that was lightning that I just saw. Uh, I'm going to have to go quickly. I don't know if you guys heard that. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the rain's starting to come in. Oh, man, it's just getting so dark. I don't have my light turned on. So it's like it seems like it's nighttime right now. Hopefully my power does not go out. I do want to try to collect as much money as possible. Just in case we get some more good familiars. Justice card. Okay. Okay. We can probably try to find something. By something, I mean the secret room. And then try to look inside there. Okay. Secret room's not there. Maybe here? Nope. 
Money's good, money's good. Money's always welcomed. Look at that. Got a dime out of it. Woo! Couple more keys. Now we gotta be a little careful with our key economy here. Because with Guppy's tail, we're gonna be spawning less keys. And, uh... If we end up running out, then we're not gonna be able to open up the golden chests that are down in the... The hush fight which you know sometimes they pay out with items sometimes they pay out with more consumables but what we are really looking for is actually the money from it so let's do this uh, no thank you troll bomb not today also the split shots from all our uh, hemolacria shots are just gonna be so devastating maybe Ooh, you know what I'm really hoping to see in the item rooms? Uh, is actually... Like, uh, either Cricket's head or Cricket's body, so that way we get even more split shots. Because that's, that, that's really gonna put a damper in Hush's day. Which, you know what, is something I am all for. We gotta go and beat up that jerk. Now, the fight's gonna be a little long, so I'll probably end up just, you know, editing, like, a sp sped up version of it or something like that. Because, well, we don't really have that good of a method of beating him up. I mean, our damage is sort of there, but we don't have anything special on top of it. If we get, like, I don't know, pop, pop would be really good. To fight against Hush, or if we get like $3 bill, fruitcake, you know, some form of tear effect. Because our, our, our luck isn't horrible. I mean, it's positive. I mean, it's at one. So any form of tear effect really isn't going to matter too much. Alright, let's just go and beat up Mom's heart. Gee, mini criminal. We just completely domed him. Uh. Hmm. Do I go for the last... I think we go for the last... Last conjoined here. And yeah, let's just go in a... Go fight Hush. I didn't find a good use to use the... Uh, the reverse card here. I mean, we could take it down to the dark room. And look at that. We got two trinkets. And some other stuff. Wait, wait, before I go inside there. Let's look down here in the membership card, and it's going to be Incubus. <laughs> uh, that is why... That is why... Adoption papers can be so good. And you know what? Sure, give me this uh, Soul of Azazel as well. We can use that in the second phase of Hush. Yeah, the second phase. Alright, let's see what's inside these item rooms. Lost soul, buddy. We can come back for you. Okay, and... Soy milk. That is... That is very, very tempting. However... Before we do anything, let's get rid of this tenant rock. It's sitting there, mocking me all smugly-like. Why did a wild card have to show up now? We didn't have any method of taking it down to the next floor. Uh, let, let, let's wait on picking up soy milk. Because that will completely destroy our damage. And yeah, we'll get a lot of tears. But it's not really going to be all that good with the build, the setup that we have. Against Hush. I mean, I will use it against, uh, you know, the lamb and blue baby later on. Just because, you know, I love soy milk. It's my favorite item. Like, come on, I have to pick it up. But I do realize that against Hush here with his boss armor, we would essentially... Oh, I'm going the wrong way. It would essentially just be, like, nothing. It, it would take forever to do this fight. I mean, we're doing pretty decent damage. We're doing more than I thought we were going to do. I mean, look at that. Hush is going to be down in 3, 2, 1... Oh, I started too soon. He's dead. Alright, down to the next floor we go.
So let's pick up soy milk and watch this. We're a machine gun of tears. <laughs> uh, I love firing so fast. And you know what? Uh, maybe we don't need adoption papers anymore. Fragmented card. Sure, come along. There's no more shops. And a down we go. If we get delirium, I'll go fight delirium. I had to double check just to make sure I had the negative. Like, look at all those tears. Where? Like, here's spun. Okay, it lowers our luck and shots speed, which is fine. I don't know if you can hear that low rumbling. Uh, we are also probably going to be at max tears, so they may... <gasps> no, you idiot! You forgot the... No, oh, I forgot the reverse card. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm starting to get a little laggy, too, because there's so many tears. So many different split shots. Uh, I can't believe I messed up. I remembered... I remembered, uh, Lost Soul, buddy. Look at that. He's got his BFF shield. His Holy Mantle. Ah, uh, you idiot. It wouldn't be one of my runs if I didn't immediately, like, ruin it. Wow. I don't know if you guys are going to have, like, a lower bitrate or something. But, uh, yeah. There's definitely... Definitely some, there may be some crunchy bitrate going on here. So let's see what we get out of the, these chests. Ooh, Glyph of Balance, thank you. Uh, too spooky, void. Do we have any other guppy? I mean, we might as well take it. Too spooky, you can, you can sit there. Yeah, I'm looking over. It looks like the bitrate is struggling a little bit. I mean, it's not like it's super flashy or anything because it's mostly just a bunch of dark colors. But hey, you never know. Or I can't really know. It's a little hard for me to know. But we also picked up one of my other really favorited uh, tier effects. I, the Occult. Or, no, not Eye of the Cult. Ocular Rift. I don't know why I get the two mixed up so much. Ocular Rift does those little rifts there. And it is a super huge hush counter. Like, if you have a character that you need hush with, I would definitely recommend picking picking up uh, Ocular Rift. Because just being able to suck all those tears in helps so much. And look at that. We do get Play-Doh Cookie, which is going to make... Well, if our bitrate was struggling before, it's definitely going to do so more now. And I can feel it on my end. It is definitely getting slightly uh, framey. I don't know if you can see that. Visually for me, it's getting framey. I don't know if it's for you guys. Oh, yep, yep, there it is. There it is. <laughs> I just looked over at my OBS and I could see that it was slowing down in there. So yeah, you guys can definitely see it. Starting to, starting to lag a little bit. And YouTube is not going to like this video at all. D1. Hmm, interesting. We can use the D1. No, 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 not in here, because there's a red heart. Sadly. Uh, we can find another another chest item here. No, oh, it's just a penny. Come on, I'm just asking for a chest. I just want to use the D1 once. Now, if we fought Hush with this... Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. If we fought Hush with the build that we have now... Oh my goodness, he would, he would like, almost instantly die. Well, not really. Almost instantly die. It would be a very quick fight. Maybe 50 or 60% faster. Yes, I did realize. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, if you... If you have any, uh, epilepsy or anything like that, this is your warning. This boss is going to be, uh... Very colorful. 
Ow, that hurts my eyes. I don't even have any issues. Uh, I did say I would go and fight... Delirium. Hmm. Let's go back and pick up the Satanic Bible, because we, we've had it for this long. Might as well keep having it. Ow. Yeah, maybe I should just end it here. The, the rain's starting to pick up a little bit, and I may lose power. Nope, I'm going to risk it. <laughs> uh, time to gamble. Come on, lost soul buddy. What do you give me? More HP? Thank you. Maybe we can find, like, Dark Princess Crown or something. So, we are in a very, very good situation here. Um, okay, I was wondering what was still alive in that hellscape of colorful pukeness. Alright, well, you're just gonna have to enjoy uh, my voice because visually I can already see YouTube screwing over the bitrate and yeah. So enjoy that. Empty vessel, sure, why not? It gives us HP. Bloat. Well, bloat's dead. Immediately. With such a tanky boss. Nun's Habit. Ooh, that's actually pretty good. That's going to make it so that way we will sometimes... Well, we, whenever we get hit. So every, what, six times we get hit, we can get uh, another HP back. Not completely self-sufficient, but it, it's pretty good. Alright, well... I'm trying don't don't look directly at at my tears. Don't look at me crying. Ow. You just had to do that, didn't you, Delirium? Well we don't need We don't need uh the fractured trinket anymore, because well it's done its job. Just trying to leave a room and come back quickly so that way it's not, uh, the tears aren't constantly there. Ah, uh, yep. In the, uh, the gold mining industry, when, uh, you're breaking up quartz, especially with a hammer, they have something called the safety squints. And in this instance, you're definitely gonna have to be putting on your safety squints. What are safety squints? It's when you squint your eyes. And uh, with all these vis with this, all this visual doo doo here, you're definitely gonna have to uh, do that. I mean, I'm being forced to, and I don't even have any of those uh, problems. All right, now that we have a double charge here. What kind of floor is this? I have, I don't think I've ever seen a, a delirium floor like or a void floor like this before. Normally they're just like all over the place. Ooh. Just aw, didn't pay out. Recently golden chests have not been paying out with items for me for not that not that much. Which is kind of okay. I mean, I'm not really expecting him to pay out all the time. Just sometimes. What is that? High Priestess card. A luck upgrade. Okay, that's going to help with our different tier effects. Tapeworm. That just gives us range. We don't really need range. Please be Delirium. I'm so done with this run. And the storm is actually starting to scare me. Mr. Dolly. Sure, come along. Don't need the HP from it because we're full. And all right, we're still continuing this this run here. I am honestly still shocked that this floor is still going on. It's still going on. Like, come on, look at that.
Uh, I may be forced to use my charges here. Because I was not paying attention to... There was a battery somewhere, wasn't there? Ah, whatever. We're, we'll, we'll be fine. What is Delirium going to do? Teleport on top of us? There he is. Finally. I think he just teleported on top. Alright, safety squints activate. Don't look directly at it. It's like staring at the sun. Oh no, also a buddy. No, <laughs> we lost him. What are we fighting for? And Delirium should be dead here shortly. There we go. All right. It definitely got really crazy at the end here. <laughs> oh, I forgot to use the death card. There you go. Uh, well, I hope you all enjoyed. I definitely had fun with this, and hopefully my internet will hold out while I upload this. But hope you stick around for more, and I will see you in the next one.